Hey guys, it's Caleb from Pave Tool. Today I want to show you a couple tricks on how to screed using our screeder package, our maxi gauge, and the maxi screed system. This setup comes with our handle, adjustable head, six foot, four foot six, and three foot screeds. We're also going to be using our maxi gauge as well as an eight foot, a six foot, a four foot, and a two foot maxi screed system. It comes as a set. As you can see here, we have an existing edge or fixed edge with some pavers that we already had done. We do need to make this area ADA compliant, so we did take out some of our blue stone pieces here, and now we're gonna put a little ramp in. So I have pipe set on one side. I have our maxi gauge that's gonna be up against our edge over here. So if I wanted to be more like two and a quarter for a two and three eighths paver, probably be a little bit better seeing as we're doing open graded stone here. We're not going to be compacting too much. All right, so we have it set to two and a quarter. That's all set. Now all I need to do is take our gauge, run it up against this edge, and screed it off. So here I got our screeder package using the three foot blade. It makes it a little bit easier just to move our stone around. And also put the six footer blade on. As you can see here, we're doing an open graded base. It's going to be super crucial in an application like this. We're going up against a concrete slab or a concrete overlay and having open graded stone is going to allow this area here to fill up with some of that water and not get the freeze thaw cycle that you would get on a gravel base. So now I have this section down below here. It's not six foot and that's what I was using before the six foot blade to screed this. Um, so I'm going to swap this out for the four foot. It'll make it a little bit easier to work with and not so cumbersome. And it's super simple to switch out. It's just a matter of turning this knob, sliding it off the six footer, set that off to the side, put on the four. Now the nice part about this screed as well, the maxi gauge and the maxi screeds, is that I can actually adjust this width by a little bit. So if it's four foot exact, you can set it to four foot. Otherwise you can adjust it to be more like four foot five, four foot six, all the way up to about, let's see here, about five foot. So now you can adjust that, like I had mentioned before, to a different distance. Here we're gonna want it as tight as possible. So we're right on that edge, tighten up my knob, and now I'm good to go. My height's all set. Make sure our area is clean over here and ready to screed. I'm using a level here just to check my pipes once more before I screed here, making sure I'm down on top of them. It's pitching that half a bubble like I want it to. I can also keep moving down to check that. Still doing exactly what I want it to. And if you look here, it looks like it's almost getting a little bit low underneath this next one. As you can see, it's rocking a little bit. We wanna make sure we solve that before we have any issues. So what I'll do is I'll pick it up just that little bit. Now, we're off and running. It's right where I want it to be. So making sure that your screed rails are perfectly set before you start screeding is extremely important because that's what's gonna determine your top surface and how perfect it is. Nice feature about our screeder package is being to actually scoop the stone as well. Get a little bit in there for filling your joints. So as you can see here, makes it easy to fill it up there. Now I have that ability to actually stretch that arm out. Now I can reach across 
and pull that stone back with me. As you can see here, we have our local dealer bringing in our product, super excited. We got our base all ready to go. We screeded our number nine stone, pavers are here and we're in good shape. It's super important to place these right where you want them on a job site. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Appreciate it. Creating your projects is one of the most crucial and most important parts of your job. Make sure you get a screeder package or a maxi gauge, something that's going to help you screed more efficient and more accurately.